what's up guys zeus here with another video quick reminder that if you do like what you're watching don't forget to like and comment on the video and press that subscribe button if you want to see more of me now i'm glad that i'm getting back to the good old stuff you know just me doing a nice little voiceover video it's been a bit i'm starting to be on and off but i'm sorry i am busy with school and stuff you know gotta manage both Got, gotta have priorities I'm not going to ditch you guys, though. I'm still going to be making sure to put content out there for y'all to watch. But yeah, as you can see, I am playing Bon Bon. And we all know my Bon Bon is a bit um, <sighs> on the rough side. My, my Bon Bon is not the best. It's not the worst, but it's not great. <laughs> now, as you can see, I am chasing a Merc first, which is already rule i'm already breaking rule number one of playing hunter not chasing a mercenary but it ends up working out in my favor and as you can see i also am running peepers on bonbon bon instead of blink like i usually do now the reason i'm running peepers is because i can't hit chain bombs to save my life we've seen this in previous videos where i can just go like without hitting a chain bomb at all so I have peepers to just like help that out since I am still learning. And I am still like a guess you could say a beginner bonbon. Bon. Now I go to destroy the global and I don't notice that the forward goes for rescue. Like I, I was like so confused. I was like where who's coming for rescue? Why is my tinnitus ringing? And here you see the merc pull something off because bonbon bon hitbox. <laughs> then the merc elbow pads away while the forward is heading to middle broken. Now, Perfumer and Priestess are the only two decoders, and now I'm just trying to get this Merc down as fast as possible since he's already been on chair. Now, once again, do I recommend you doing this if you are playing Hunter? No, this is something that you don't want to do. But this is a problem with Merc discipline. This mercenary is trying their hardest not to waste their elbow pads because in their heads, they're like, oh, I need my elbow pads if I'm going to pull off a rescue but that soul like purpose is literally the reason why the merc is going down so fast like had the merc used the elbow pad back in bottom broken before i smacked the merc could have continued the kite and it would have been about a three cipher kite before i even knocked the mercenary instead now it's the merc is dead on chair there's only three ciphers only two ciphers popped and nobody's coming for rescue from the looks of it so now here I have wanted on the priest on the I said priestess hello on the perfumer and I do chuck a remote bomb and boom I managed to get the hit on the perfumer which means now the perfumer can't come for rescue or otherwise she will get sacked. Now when I was looking back at this recording I was like oh wow the forward what's he about to do? And then I remember when I'm recording, I this is at that point you can see my highlight. I start walking away from the merc because I'm like, okay, nobody's coming for rescue. The forward here could have actually gone for rescue behind my back. But he chose not to. So that was also another mistake on the survivor's part. But here I do go to the perfumer since she's already one bomb. Look at this. I just want you to watch this. She perfumes back and somehow I get pallet stunned. I don't know how, but I got pallet stun, so I'm like, okay, pallet stun box, cool, we love that, we stand this. And at this point, there is two ciphers left, about to be one, because forward is doing shack cipher, and priestess is the only person that's not decoding. So now I'm chasing this perfumer, and I'm just trying to do my best to chain bomb, etc, etc. And yeah, I ignore the priestess because I don't really care. And here she does a good mind game because she knows I have up. So if I vault and she TP and she perfumes back, I can't chase her. I'm going to have to go all the way around and then it's going to be a hassle. Forward does end up popping his cypher in about three, two, one. Right there, right on cue. And Bon Bon hitbox once again. I bounce off LMAO. So now there's one cypher. And Priestess is doing perfumers. Original cypher. So this is looking like a very, very strong draw scenario. Now here, I put pressure on the cypher. This is also on the perfumer because the perfumer did kite towards the final cypher. And I am a bonbon bon and I can chip damage off everyone without even knowing. I do manage to knock the perfumer here and priestess. It looks like she was baiting me to make me scared in order to think that she was going to like do a force portal rescue. And then pop the cypher. But she ends up not doing that forward stuns me forces the rescue and i originally try to go and then i say nope cypher cypher uh-uh 
Cypher, as you can see, is 95, and I'm playing this game like it's perfectly primed. I missed that hit on the Priestess, which is very sad. I do get the Chain Bomb, but here I do miss the Remote Bomb. Like I said, my Bon Bon is not the best. Perfumer is here ringing my Tinnitus, so I decide to put a Peeper down so I can chase, and then I immediately turn back once that Peeper starts going off. This would be the second reason why I brought peepers because control. This look forward instantly got in the range of my peeper, and like that, I was notified and I was able to instantly turn back. I do get a chip nice off on the forward, so like the peepers are like really out here, just like coming in clutch for my chain bombing. Like, GG's got like, but this is still very possible to be a draw scenario. Now, <laughs> here the perfumer calls a global, and this ends up killing the priestess. The Perfumer did ping hunters near me for the priestess to cancel the global, but the priestess didn't listen. So because of that, I was able to put priestess on chair. And with Perfumer one hit to bomb and forward needing bomb hit to be sacked, all of a sudden, this game is now very pressured. One mistake, and that's the game. Now here you will see I switched over to excitement and the full, I do use the excitement, but I was like three seconds off because I didn't have all three peepers ready. So because of that, it bought me time, but not a lot. So now here, I don't know how much football the forward has. He does, use his football, and then that's clip. But Priest, this is dead on chair. Forward is going to go for rescue. And yeah. Um, forward tries to do an insta rescue. I TS him. I TS him again after Perfumer pops. Now, this is where I fuck up. So, I showed you guys my build in the beginning. I didn't have detention. I was hitting her because I thought I had detention. And I'm like, oh, wait, I don't have detention. Crap, did I just throw? So, I'm like, no, 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 it's all cool. So, here, I managed to knock the Perfumer after she tries to 360 me. And I go instantly for the forward because I know Perfumer has a 30% healing debuff when it comes to her self-heal speed. So, I chair my forward. I see Priestess is opening up the gate. I try to throw a remote bomb. I mess it up. You know, big rips. My bonbon bon is not the best. But I mainly did this video in order to throw tribute over to Arcus because, you know, did make a promise to my boy. I said, nah, I'm going to play bonbon bon more because, you know, why not? So, Arcus, if you're watching this, I hope you're proud of me. I'm playing Peeper just like you. And I'm mooning. Thank you, Arcus. I appreciate it. <laughs> all right enough with that so i'm getting tired because i don't know if the priestess is coming for save or not and i don't and i'm scared for perfumer self-heal so i decide to just share perfumer now there i could have remote bond but the only thing is that my animation i was scared that it would give her enough time to rescue but to be fair she got the rescue off regardless so it didn't matter now instead of chasing the priestess i go for the forward reason why front gates open if forward gets the rescue on the perfumer it's a tie just like that and i do manage to chain bomb but yeah hope you guys enjoy the video i'm zeus and i'm out love you all